Hello everyone. Uh, myself, Dr. Ankur Jindal. I am a consultant in pediatric clinical immunology and rheumatology at Manipal Hospital, Old Airport Road, Bangalore. I will be speaking about uh, uh, autoimmune rheumatic diseases in children today. Autoimmune rheumatic diseases are a group of disorders wherein your immune system goes wrong and it starts acting your own body. It can affect your skin, your uh, blood cells, uh, your kidney and it can affect any any part of the body uh, for that matter. Common clinical manifestations of autoimmune rheumatic diseases in children include fever which can be prolonged without any identifiable cause. It can also present with the uh, uh, swelling in the joint or joint pains, rash uh, sometime which this rash could be photosensitive anemia, unexplained hypertension, unexplained fatigue, unexplained weight loss. The most common rheumatic disease uh, in children is arthritis uh, that presents with joint swelling or joint uh, uh, pain uh, uh, typically often associated with early morning stiffness. If left untreated uh, uh, arthritis can lead to severe deformity of the joints and can lead to a very impaired quality of life of uh, children. There are many other autoimmune rheumatic diseases such as systemic lupus erythematosus, juvenile dermatomyositis. Uh, which could potentially be life-threatening and early identification of these disorders is extremely important to prevent mortality in these patients. Children with rheumatic diseases may often present with unexplained uh, manifestations, unexplained uh, non-specific manifestation. How do we evaluate patients with autoimmune rheumatic diseases? The most common test uh, that we do for autoimmune rheumatic disease is antinuclear antibody which is present in many autoimmune rheumatic diseases and it provides a very good uh, uh, diagnostic marker. How do we manage a patient with uh, uh, autoimmune rheumatic disease? So we have to give certain medications that uh, suppress that overactive part of the immune system. Uh, we call them as immunosuppressive medications or immunomodulatory medications. There are several such medications available. Uh, most often we use corticosteroids, but there are several other medications such as methotrexate, mycophenolate morphetil, azathioprine. The evaluation and management of uh, autoimmune rheumatic diseases in children is also multidisciplinary. With available uh, treatment options, early identification, early uh, initiation of management, we can uh, um, reduce morbidity in these patients and we can provide them a very good quality of life and uh, definitely prevent mortality in patients with uh, autoimmune rheumatic diseases. Thank you so much.